June 7th, June 7th, 1957. The radio announcer, we didn't have TV then, the radio announcer came on the radio and he didn't say, our forces have entered through the Lion's Gate and now they're advancing to the Temple Mount. No. Instead, in a broken, crying voice, he said to the people, our feet are standing within thy gates, O Jerusalem, a city united. And so with the words of the psalmist, we learned that for the first time in 2,000 years, flag of an independent state of Israel was flying above the Temple Mount. <laughs> About 20 years ago, maybe even 25 now, a new Christian, and you all understand that term, mm -hmm. a new Christian, I have to explain it to Jewish groups, <laughs> um, a new Christian came here and was uh, guided by Mayor Ben Dove, who was the leading archaeologist of what he used to call this silly stair project. <laughs> and. He told him very much what I had just told you. And the man began to cry. And Mayor Ben Dove looked at him and said, why are you crying? He said, I want you to know that for me to stand on these stairs is more meaningful than when I walked on the moon. The man was Neil Armstrong. <laughs> and as you can see, we have one narrow stair, one wide stair, one narrow stair, one wide stair so that you couldn't race up the stairs. It broke your stride, so you had to stop and listen and learn as you were coming up to the town. We're sitting in such a unique place. For behind you, the history going back 2,000 years. Ahead of you, the history that goes back 3,000 years. Just ahead of us, the beginning of David's city and the whole story of Jerusalem becoming its capital at Jeremiah.